Well, we learned today that Indiana, a business here, has a pretty unique connection to the game last night. Carlos Diaz did the investigation, and he takes us now to FBF Originals. They are a company in Martinsville, and we see the socks that they're making now for the Pats fans. Yeah, it might have been a boring Super Bowl, and of course, our Colts weren't in it, and our arch rival Patriots did win it. But there is one company in Indiana that's making out like bandits. It's the FBS Original Sock Company here on the south side in Martinsville. Look at all this yarn up here, red, white, and blue yarn. And they're making socks with the Patriots logo and the Super Bowl logo with 2018 Super Bowl champions, of course, because it's from the 2018 season. We're here with John from FBF Originals. And so how long have you guys been making these awesome, well, I can't say awesome as the Patriots on them, yeah. but these high-quality <laughs> Super Bowl socks? We've been a licensee with the NFL for over 20 years. Look at that right there. You can see it kind of being moved over right there. That's the sock right there being moved over. So for 20 years, go ahead. With the NFL, but we've been making socks since 1984. Mm -hmm. So how many needles are in this machine right here? Do you have a guess? A uh, million? I'd say a million, no. million bucks. 168 needles. 168 needles. And how many socks are coming out per hour? It takes less than two minutes to make one sock. We're starting from this yarn up here, and then the, the yarn comes down through this section through here. Right, and this what we're looking at now forms the tube, or the, the main part of the sock. And when it's complete, and you'll see threads being pulled, and the stitching process is happening, and then it gets pulled over to the other side. That is being sewn the toe of the sock. Oh, so you can see the toe, see right in there. The toe is being sewn right there. You can see. After a second, I'm going to press this button right here, watch, the sock will get pulled over after it's made and threaded up, it gets pulled over. And I love this mechanism here. This is so cool. The sock is pulled out of where all those needles, and see the needles, those are spinning over. It gets pulled out of that section, and then it gets sucked up into a tube like that, and then it gets turned inside out so that the toe or the, the toe of the sock can be sewn on there. This will be going out to retailers across the country this afternoon and through tomorrow, and we'll take care of all those Super Bowl fans, at least those Patriot fans. It, exactly. And so, yeah, not too many Los Angeles orders going out. And our crew was watching the Super Bowl, and mm -hmm. as soon as the game ended, we started changing out all the thread and all the yarn on all these machines to the sea of red, white, and blue that you see today. So here's hoping that next year it's going to be royal blue and white for the Colts when they win the Super Bowl. Absolutely. But for now, oh, Martinsville has to endure these Patriot socks <laughs> being sewn up all morning long. Thanks so much, John. Thank you. Let's get back to the studio. All right. Thank you, Carlos. Boy, now they have an inventory of all the Rams colors, the blue and the yellow. What are they going to do with that? You know? That's not, that's not even our blue, is it? It's not Colt's blue. Uh, no, it's no, not. It's no, it's not. No, it's not. All right. <laughs>